Welcome Libras. I'm back today with another video for you guys. So let's get it popping because I know last month you guys' reading was, you know, a little on the extreme side. So let's get, I'm hoping we get a better read for the month of August. I feel like August energy is so, like, I just feel like August is going to be a good month for a lot of us. Um, so I'm hoping for a good reading for you guys. And let's cleanse this energy from last month that y'all had going on. Because y'all reading was really, like, intense. <laughs> so let's cleanse that energy away. Let's start fresh. All right? So um, don't forget, guys, to check out my merchandise. It's below the video. You can check out my T-shirts. And I have a few face masks as well. Um, as well as if you would like to book your very own personal reading with me, that information is in the description box below. Um, I also have sage bundles for sale as well as oils and candles as well, okay? Handcraft, crafted by me. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and get started for the month of August. What messages do you have for Libras? What messages are there for Libras? I got the two of wands. So it looks like you guys are making plans, prepping, and looking towards, looking forward, okay, to the future. You're trying to look past something that was heartbreaking, the sorrow or pain. There could have been a breakup of some sort. You could have found out about a third party here with the two of pentacles and a three of swords. Somebody could have been doing a juggling act. You're trying to move on from this situation. Okay, you're trying to let it go and you're looking for it. You're looking ahead. We got the King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I'm definitely picking up on Gemini's energy heavy. But I feel like you had to you feel like you had to walk away from you had to make a decision to walk away from somebody that you love and actually care about. Okay, you got the lovers here and I got the eight of cups. All right, so, or some of you guys are planning on um, planning on leaving um, or going on a trip or taking some time away, okay? For some of you, this is about self-love. I see that clearly as well, too. Some of y'all are, um, yeah, this person could be older. We got the emperor. Could be dealing with the Aries as well, okay? This could be a father. This could be a uncle, a, a dad. Uh, uh, something, someone older, okay? But I'm getting a king of swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or Aries. I feel like you want to talk up, you want to talk to them about doing something together, coming together. Oh, wow. Mm. I got the devil and the three of cups. I don't even want to say what that looked like, but I'm just saying, like, I'm getting a conversation. You want to, you want to talk to this person. For some of you, this is about talk to, talking to someone. Could be dealing with the Capricorn, but with the Three of Cups and the Devil, that looks really freaky. I'm just saying. I'm just putting that out there. I know everybody's not into that, but I'm just putting it out there. Yeah, the Knight of Wands. <laughs> Very much so playful energy. Like, I'm getting like... For some of you, this is dealing with like with a baby father. Definitely see that with this um, emperor card here. Someone that's authority. I'm getting that like someone that you respect. Um, someone that you possibly look up to. But I'm getting that there's like this is something that's like a fun thing or something that's you know with the Knight of Wands. I'm getting like to see. I'm getting like there's three people. I'm getting three people. Three of swords and two of pentacles. Definitely like a love triangle here of some sort. And I'm getting like every. This could be um, a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But I'm getting like some. This is younger energy. Somebody that's not ready to settle down. Some energy that's like all over the place. Okay. Not really settled. 
You've been getting this. You've been getting attention. Six of Pentacles and a Six of Wands, or you've been giving someone attention. The start of argument. Okay, so I'm getting that there's there's this uh, the Fool and the Five of Wands is definitely starting an argument to get attention. So I'm not sure if you're doing this or if someone is doing this to you, but. I'm getting like someone starting an argument to get attention. You want this to come to an end or it did come to an end. But it's it was on your mind a lot with the tower and the nine of swords. So you thought about it a lot. You thought about it a lot. Future energy. We got the nine of cups. So this is a wish fulfillment. Nine of, I mean, King of Pentacles and the Magician. You're trying to make somebody jealous. There could be like a sugar daddy with the King of Pentacles here. Or someone who's very financially stable. Someone that you could call when you are like going through like a, you know, that can help you out. But the Magician and the Five of Swords is definitely making somebody jealous. Nine of Cups here, you want somebody to be jealous. I'm getting... Like Libra, y'all sounding real. <laughs> What's going on? All right, temperance. Okay, so you're trying to keep your money and your finances balanced with the temperance and the ace of pentacles. Okay. Why is temperance here? Some of you uh, need are going to possibly need some work done on a car with the temperance and the chariot could be dealing with a cancer how are others viewing other people view you as you you know queen of swords that's your energy why is the queen of swords here This person could also look at you as kind of selfish with the four of pentacles. And you change when you get money with the um, will of fortune and the five of pentacles. Your hopes and fears is the seven of wands. <laughs> So, I felt like there is a little bit of confrontation. Like, do you, um, I feel like you ready. You got your guard up with seven of wands. And you waiting for this person to pop off. Like, you waiting for it. You, were, you waiting and ready for it. So, this is some beef that you got with somebody. Could it possibly be over a man with the emperor there? Why is the emperor here? The Justice card. Libra's energy. Why is Justice here? I'm feeling like this could be even like a judge. Somebody not happy about something. Somebody not happy. Yeah, somebody don't like some. Somebody don't like. You don't like this person like that or something like that. Something in that nature like somebody doesn't want a relationship or somebody's not ready for a relationship. But you're talking plans with, you're talking plans, you're talking future plans with this King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay, Queen of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Oh, two of swords and the high priestess. Something's not a secret. Or you don't know about something. Or you don't know why this person is mad. Okay. So you, I feel like you're having a conversation possibly with this king of swords. Um, you're getting like an opinion. Like you're talking to someone and possibly telling your side of the story. About how you don't like someone or um, 
something to that nature, okay? This person possibly is like in and out with the Knight of Wands. Yeah, like they leave and come back with the Knight of Wands and the Eight of Cups. Yeah, like trying to come back or trying to walk away from something here. Why is the Eight of Pentacles? Okay, trying to make somebody leave. Yeah, somebody started an argument. To try to make somebody leave. That's what I get. So it looks like y'all tried to start an argument possibly with somebody to make somebody leave. Or you feel like they did that to you. Why is the nine of cups here? King of Wands. I feel like you're trying to get like an understanding or a balance on the situation as well too, like on how to move forward. But you feel like the situation, somebody did, somebody, there was some betrayal in the situation. Like you feel like you was done wrong. You feel like you was done wrong with Ten of Swords and the Devil. You feel like you was done wrong in the situation. Yeah, you felt like you was done wrong. What's the outcome? The outcome, we got the star card. Could be dealing with an Aquarius. Like, what is this? You feel like this person jealous of what you have. Five of Swords and Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles, you might feel like you got more than this person or... You feel like you're more successful than this person. But why is you why why is the five of swords here? Like why y'all beefing like that? Why is the five of swords here? King of Pentacles. Okay. I'm getting like there could be like a a disagreement and I I dare I say it about a man. Why is the King of Pentacles? It's hope. You hoping that somebody don't find out about something. But I'm getting that there's a, a man involved in this situation. And it's like a man involved in a situation that's possibly very, that has a lot of money and is a great resource of some sort. But I'm getting like there's this beef or battle between you and someone and there's possibly a man or two men involved, okay? So y'all let me know what's going on in the conversation. Y'all, let me let me get y'all some more sage because I thought y'all was going to do better. I thought y'all was going to do better this month, but it feel like as the world turns. So let me, let me give y'all some extra support here. Let's sage away that energy and start fresh. August is going to be a great month. Let's not ruin it with drama all right so y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below if you want to book a personal read y'all let me know because i'm running specials this month information is going to be in the drop box below okay chat with y'all later